I wanted to share first with you today that probably the most significant creation that I've created today is clarity of like who's my intended audience, who I'm speaking to, and you know YouTube's pretty broad and I'm going to be sending this out over Facebook and my blog and YouTube and I was you know thinking about how I was going to be understood by anybody who might tune in. I manifested some contrast that really helped to give me some clarity is my son, my youngest son who's in his early 20s. I talked to him about you know Abraham's teachings and I talked to him about um, manifesting and synchronicity and expansion and all these cooperative words like cooperative components and sometimes he gets frustrated he looks at me like you know no, what the heck are you talking about? He's not interested in listening to Abraham. He's uh, not lis interested in listening to Bashar's teachings, which I'm really into. But nevertheless, what's really um, fun and amazing is we're a vibrational match. Um, he's right up to speed. He's, you know, that next generation that sometimes I got to keep up with him because it's absolutely natural and normal for him to not give a rip what other people think and uh, to follow his highest excitement. So anyways, I digress a little bit. The point is that, you know, he provided the contrast for me that he kept, you know, saying, you know, well, not everybody's going to understand, you know, you use this terminology, I don't get what you mean. And so I, you know, played around with that a little bit. But I went through this alignment and process. I finally really got clear, really clear. Today I'm like, I know that I don't care about, you know, trying to have everybody understand where I'm coming from. Um, the law of attraction is going to match me up with you, with those of you who understand, who are a match to what they're at, you're asking for what I'm expressing. The very quote that I attracted today in an Abraham Hicks YouTube, you know, a video on YouTube of Abraham Hicks recording, which I will put in up here some kind of a link to that. I haven't even finished listening to it yet, but it had this um, thing that Abraham, this quote that Abraham said in it, that was just like that that last piece that I needed to take me to that tipping point of alignment, where it's now easier for me to line up with what I want than to not. And I'm just going to read it. Um, let's see. It's everything's been amassed. The other people, the other people with the perfect attitudes because the people that didn't match your creation weren't drawn in. Only what works for what you've asked for has been drawn here. And that's how I feel. I mean, the law of attraction is going to only align those subscribers and those to watch this video, watch my vlog, daily vlog, that have been drawn here. As long as my focus is clear, my vibration isn't messed up, <laughs> you know, isn't split, um, you people are, from my perspective, the ones with perfect attitudes. So, here's to you. <laughs> and it's going to be really fun to have leading edge conversations. Um, and that's what I plan on doing. Um, weeding. Popping out some weeds. Um, let's see. I wanted to add to what I shared yesterday about not working, not having a job, but my needs getting met, and um, manifesting abundance. Well, one of the things I have been doing for, um, well, it's kind of hard to put a time limit on it, but for over a year is I have been living at this um, residence in Ashland, Oregon, that is also um, a healing um, sanctuary. A healing. Oh. Hello. Hello. I'm recording myself, so if you hear me talking to myself, I'm not too crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, the place is called Transition Sanctuary, and I do exchange um, my living arrangements. My living. I have my own cabin, and I have utilities, and I'll I'll share much more with you later but um, in exchange for that. And it's a really sweet deal. Um, 
it's really neat how it's unfolded, how it's manifested. More details later. But to get to the point is, my point is that um, I want to have more fun. I want to play in these vlogs. Uh, if you know me at all, you know I'm about having fun with it, being easy about it, and playing. So I just want to get started on that. And it's interesting to try to, nope, no, to allow <laughs> having fun and also expressing the things that I want to express. But so to start out, I got this inspired idea. Pretty simple, but um, I'm going to show you what I did. Hold on. <sighs> Grab the camera. So anyways, this is the sign. I was just weeding out here. This is the sign of where I live. It's the mailbox. And isn't that cool? I am and I live on Paradise Lane. Can you beat that? I manifested that. Okay, and here is Transition Sanctuary. There's a little free advertising for Lawrence Katz. <laughs> and this is my silly little playful thing that I did today. I stuck some sunglasses on the old eagle here. <laughs> and uh, what's also a little bit funny about, uh, about that in particular is Lawrence is off right now to the airport to pick up his new potential sweetheart that he's been, he connected with. Hi, kitty, come and see me. He connected on, um, I don't know, somehow through the internet and has been Skyping for a while and she's coming to visit from out of state. And so he's a little bit nervous about that. She's coming to stay for a few days and I get to meet her. <laughs> And he's bringing her back here shortly. Hi, kitty. Want to get on YouTube? Do I have permission to put you on my, my YouTube vlog? Come here. You want some loving? This is the neighbor kitty. Yeah. So anyways, we're being silly here. And we're putting some sunglasses on the old eagle. So we're not so stuffy. So we play. <laughs> 